I've learned that I shouldn't waste my weekends by worrying about what faces me in the office on Monday. I've learned that you should never let your four-year-old brother cut your hair. I've learned that whoever said you can't buy happiness forgot about puppies. I've learned that Thursdays are yes days. People are more open and relaxed and more favorable on Thursdays. I've learned that grandmothers hate washing off little fingerprints left by precious little hands of their grandchildren. I've learned that the best friend is someone who loves you when you forget to love yourself. I've learned that the fastest way to get green lights is to start writing something down while you're out of red lights. And I've learned that the best to buy the expensive paint that covers in one coat. I've learned that peeing in the woods with a couple friends can be a real bonding experience. And I've learned as a lifeguard that when you throw nickels in the pool without anyone seeing you, it brings many smiles to children who find them. And I've learned that I'd rather have a lot of brothers and sisters and not get many things that have no brothers and sisters and get everything. I'd rather have many brothers and sisters and little things than a lot of things and no brothers and sisters. I've learned that when you're looking for something, it's usually the last one in the pile. I've learned that the slowest lane of traffic is always the one I'm in. And I've learned that sometimes the thing that scare you the most turn out to be the best times of your life. I've learned that it's easy to be critical about something that you've never experienced. And I've learned that to really understand how much my father loves me, I needed to have my own son. And I've learned that you should thank a sales clerk who takes the time to compare the signatures on your credit card with the signature on your receipt. I've learned that going to the doctor's office is like going to church. You don't want to be late, but you don't want to be there too early either. And I've learned that everything I truly value has been gained by vulnerability on my part. It's a secret to life. And I've learned that just because you've gotten in the last word, it doesn't mean you won the argument. And I've learned that my mom smells better when she doesn't have perfume on. And I've learned that trying to smile while saying soy sauce will always make you laugh. I've learned that by the time you retire and draw social security, everything you have either hurts or doesn't even work. And I've learned that when the duties of being a teacher overwhelm me, my students always almost brighten my day in some small way. I've learned that you should never blow a big bubble with your gum if your head is out of the window of a car going 40 miles per hour and you have long hair. And I've learned that when I'm alone in my room, sometimes I stare at... Just kidding. I've learned that when I'm alone in my room, I have beautiful, I have a beautiful singing voice. I've learned that no matter how busy someone is, they're never too busy to tell you how busy they are. I've learned that it's just as important to be friendly to the janitor as it is to be friendly to the company president. And I've learned that work enjoyed is as much as work of leisure. I've learned that I can't change the past, but I can let it go. I've learned that no matter what time I decide to go to the bank, Everyone else has decided to go then too. I've learned that having extra time to spend with my children is more important than having extra money to spend on them. I've learned that kids will pretty much meet the expectations that you set for them. I've learned that when a woman says that she's not mad, she is. I've learned that you never ever wear an overpriced bridesmaid dress again at another event no matter what the bride tells you. I've learned that when my dad says he's going to barbecue, it means we're going to have a burnt piece of meat for supper. I've learned that I'm glad I grew up poor. It taught me that one doesn't need a lot of money to be happy and that there's an advantage to having to struggle a bit. I've learned that when asking my child what he's up to, never believe the reply, nothing. I've learned that arguing with a teenager is like mud wrestling with a pig. You both get dirty and the pig loves it. I've learned that learning to laugh at yourself is the surest sign of maturity. And I've learned that mom makes mistakes too. I've learned that 20 years, no one is going to care about what it is you got on your biology final. I've learned that no matter how many clothes I iron the night before, I'll end up wearing something else. And I've learned that what people want most in life is to be loved and appreciated. And I've learned that life isn't fair, so accept it and adjust. I've learned that sometimes you should just let your heart decide and deal with reality later. I've learned that God gives you a new gift every day. I've learned that you should never ever leave a seven-year-old with a bat and a ball alone by a window while babysitting him. I've learned that sandwiches cut diagonally 
taste better. I've learned that yuck, it's not the best response when your mom tells you what's for dinner. I've learned that if you hang something in a closet for a while, it shrinks two sizes. I've learned that nothing tastes as good as being thin feels. Nothing tastes as good as being ripped feels. I've learned that whenever I get mad at my mom, I should try to remember that she loves me. I've learned that peer pressure is just too much. When I'm alone, I'm completely a different person than when I'm at school. I've learned that the way to speak of your spouse and to the others and either builds up family or casts a cloud over it. And I've learned that it's disastrous to forget your anniversary. I've learned that the one loss doesn't make up a season of losses. And I've learned that a great picker, upper, is when I hear my grandchild say, Come sit by me, Grandma. I've learned that you should never give your brother the squirt gun when it's loaded with water. And I've learned that life is full of good surprises, even if they do seem to come far apart. I've learned that you can't give a hug without getting one in return. I've learned that you should never take sides when your friends are upset with each other. I've learned that having someone tell you he loves you and having someone show you that he loves you are two completely different things. And I've learned that what makes me happiest is my son holding my face in his hands and telling me I'm the best mom he could ever have. I've learned that it's a good idea to ask for some details before you say yes when someone asks, can you do me a small favor? Ask for some details first. I've learned that you always gain five pounds on a scale at the doctor's office. I've learned that all your school's pictures look good except the ones in your yearbook that everyone sees forever. And I've learned that a dropped screw or a nail in the garage becomes instantly invisible. I've learned that a good friend is better than a therapist. I've learned that you can't make friends by waiting for other people to step forward. You need to make the first move. I've learned that my piano teacher gets a funny look on her face when she notices I haven't practiced. I've learned that onion breath isn't bad when your spouse has it too. I've learned that the copy machine can tell when I'm in a hurry. I've learned that you should never teach your little brother how to use a slingshot. I've learned that you're never too old for slumber parties. I've learned that there's a very crucial difference between charm and character. I've learned that my grandparents can be just as much of joy to their grandchildren as their grandchildren are to them. And I've learned that planning a vacation is sometimes just as much as fun as experiencing it. I've learned that my father lets me do things my mother would never think about. I've learned that you shouldn't talk about what you're doing, to, what you're going to do. Do it and then talk. From now on for the rest of your life, don't talk about things you're going to do. Do it, then talk. I've learned that it's possible to fall madly in love with just one glance. I've learned that there's no greater feeling of self-worth than when you help someone in need. I've learned that receiving a thoughtful note of unexpected act of kindness from someone can make my day. I've learned that the question parents hate most is why. I've learned that chocolate is a food group. I've learned that while it's important to be my daughter's friend, it's more important to be her mother. I've learned that I shouldn't change the channel when my dad's watching the Dallas Cowboys. I've learned that sometimes P.S. to a letter is the most important message of all. I've learned that leisure isn't enjoyed unless it's been earned. I've learned that it's the teacher and not the subject that makes class interesting. I've learned that parents always bring up those embarrassing childhood stories at all the wrong moments. I've learned that competing with a friend for competing with a friend over a man in a fun game. I've learned that competing with a friend over a man is a fun game unless one of you actually wins. And I've learned that I shouldn't call my identical twin sister ugly. I've learned that having a boss who makes you sick isn't a terminal condition. And I've learned that adolescence is a time of growing and experiencing. I just didn't know it would hurt so much. I've learned that nothing is better than coming home to a lit fireplace on a cold, snowy night and drinking hot chocolate. I've learned that because my parents believe in me, I believe in me. I've learned that when you go somewhere and they say, don't bring valuables, don't 
bring valuables. I've learned that you spend your first year in your children's lives trying to get them to walk and talk and the rest of your life trying to get them to sit down and shut up. I've learned that no matter how much work husband's, husband, a husband does around the house, if he doesn't know how to give his wife affection, the marriage can go down the drain. I've learned that imagining God standing beside me stops me from doing things that I know are wrong. I learned that imagining God standing beside me stops me from doing things I know are wrong. And I've learned that I get in trouble if I lick a lollipop and then let my dog lick it and lick it again. I've learned that when you take your girlfriend out for lunch and she orders the salad bar because she's on a diet, before the lunch is over, she'll eat half of your cheese fries. And I've learned that a position can be bought, but respect, it must be earned. I've learned that wherever I go, I should try to leave it either cleaner or happier than it was before I arrived. I've learned that the best gift to give or receive is a book that touches the heart. I've learned that a little dog, that a little dog hair never hurt anybody. I've learned that you should never fall in love at a summer camp. It ends, but life goes on. I've learned that any cheap brownie mix can be good when chocolate chips are added to the batter. I've learned that you have no, that you have to kiss a lot of frogs before you find a prince. I've learned that if you can laugh at yourself, you'll always be amused. I've learned that it scares me to walk in the bathroom and see my grandpa's teeth on the sink. I've learned that money talks, but all mine ever says is goodbye. I've learned that you should never put a rubber snake in your older brother's bed. I've learned that your children can make, I've learned that your children can make you happier or matter than you ever been in your life. I've learned that you shouldn't write the name of whom you love really big on your new backpack that you have to wear to school every day. I've learned that when a society accepts the premise that individuals are not responsible for their own actions, then it's in real trouble. I've learned that it's hard to determine where to draw the line between being nice and not hurting people's feelings and standing up for what I believe. I've learned that college isn't about preparing for your future career. It's about finding out who you are right now. I've learned that I love being a senior. It's, in gradu it's graduation I'm not worried about. I've learned that no matter what mood I'm in, James Taylor is always perfect. And I've learned that life is like a book. Sometimes we must close a chapter to begin the next one. That's right. I've learned that your best friend is the person who comes to your dance recitals and names goldfish after you. I've learned that there's only two classes, first class and no class. I've learned that giving doesn't count if you don't want what you're giving away. I've learned that giving doesn't count if you don't want what you're giving away. I've learned that within each person is a treasure, but sometimes you have to dig for it.